now I've realized that when I take the time to wake up and make sure that I'm prepared every morning for these shows. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing a little bit about my day job with you guys and what that consists of. It's pretty different from a normal day job, but I want to show you guys what I do and what I've been doing for the past couple of years to support myself. Um, yeah, so let's get right into this. First, I want to give a shout out to my very much appreciated Patreon members. As I always say, my community is constantly growing over there and it just fills me up with so much joy and I love having new members join my Patreon. If you guys don't know, I post every single week on Patreon and there's tons of exclusive content over there that you can't find anywhere else. So if you want to get to know me a little bit better, definitely check out my Patreon. You won't be disappointed. Okay guys, so I made a video a couple years back and I really just wanted to show you guys what I do during the day and how I support myself, how I pay my bills. I've really grown a community on CB and I'm really proud of that. So if you guys didn't know, I do cam on a website called CB Monday through Friday and on Monday through Wednesday I'm online from 9am to 11am Pacific time and then on Thursdays and Fridays I'm on 2pm to 4pm Pacific time. So I like to change up the times just because it gives other people an opportunity to come in and hang out with me and spend some time with me. So this new method has really been working out for me since 2022 began and I'm really happy with how my community over there is growing and I have two amazing moderators which if you guys don't know moderators are unpaid supporters that pretty much filter out all of the BS and all of the negativity and the trolls and the bots and the people that are trying to promote their rooms on my room. So I'm really grateful for my two moderators and and honestly I couldn't have brought this to the level that it's at now without them. So if you guys are watching this, thank you. I love you guys so much. They know who they are. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how I get ready for my shows each and every day. So I wake up at 4 a.m., I walk my dog, I drink my coffee to wake up, and then I go to the gym, and I'm in the gym every morning by 6 a.m. And I usually spend an hour and a half, two hours in the gym, so I'm getting back home around 7.30, and that is where I will then show you guys what comes after. Alright, well let's do this hair, get a shirt on, and get in front of the camera. One, two, three. <laughs> this is what I look like before I go online and start my shows, so I'm ready to go, I'm pumped up, I'm excited, and I will see you guys when I get done with that. Alright, well really quick, I wanted to show you guys my setup, and I've been using this setup for the past three months now, and it just works really great for me. So. Um, these lights are the best lights I've ever used. They don't cast any hard shadows. You can customize them, how bright they are, what color temperature they are. Um, over here, this is my secondary webcam, which helps with different angles and stuff like that. So if somebody tips me for anything that is like an exercise, so like jumping jacks or push-ups, which I do and they're on my tip menu, 
then I will switch over to that camera and move over here because there's more space. Usually I'm standing right here and using the webcam that's built into my iMac. Yeah, I like to keep it fun and fresh and who wants to just look at somebody just sitting at their desk the whole time? Not me. But um, yeah guys, I got my lighting set up, down pat, like I love the way everything looks. I'm usually online for about two hours, so um, if you guys ever want to come check me out, you totally should. It's always a good time over there. I have to get started with this, so I will touch base afterwards. I always make sure I light my candle before I get started. I actually made this candle, so this is orange scented and um, it's kind of like my little tester candle, but I love the way it looks. I will be selling these soon, so keep an eye out for that. And yeah, I gotta get started with my show. My followers are waiting for me, and I hope you guys are enjoying this video. So webcamming is something that I really enjoy because it gives me the freedom to do whatever I want to do. I don't have to answer to anybody, and that is something that I want in my life. It might just be part of being a Taurus or just being the type of person that I am, which is an independent, self-motivated person. I don't ever really need somebody to push me to do something or to influence me to do something. This kind of job works out perfectly for my lifestyle because it gives me freedom, but it also gives me structure at the same time. Now, for the longest time, I was wondering why I would make a lot of money this day and then almost nothing on this day, and it was because I hadn't made a routine for myself. I was just randomly hopping online and going with the flow and not really giving my best effort. The one thing I've learned this year is that you truly get what you put into things. So if you're going to give half effort into something, you can't expect to get so much enjoyment and payback from your efforts because you didn't give enough of yourself to get that payback. But now I've realized that when I take the time to wake up and make sure that I'm prepared every morning for these shows and I'm in the gym and I'm working out and I'm working hard in the gym and I'm coming back home and I'm staying regimented, it's truly been paying off for me guys and I feel amazing about it because I never knew that I could make this into a stable source of income but it's also benefiting me in so many other ways because I've been growing muscle like crazy, but you can see the progress that I've made just in three months from when I started really going hard on CB. So a lot of my tip goals are exercises. So I have my 30 pound weights right here and I'll do squats or I'll do push ups or curls, which is a really popular one, or even jumping jacks. And just the repetitiveness of those over and over and over have really been working. Like look at my arms, guys. They're not like beast status, but <laughs> they're bulging and like, I'm just feeling so happy with my progress. So overall, if you guys haven't seen me on CB, I definitely suggest you check me out over there. I can't really talk about it too much on here because it is sort of an explicit website, but you don't have to be explicit on there. Just check it out and let me know what you guys think. Like, leave a comment under this video if you have seen one of my shows in the past or you haven't seen one of my shows in the past. Let me know. I'm just really grateful for this job because it allows me to have fun. So, like, today I was dancing to Britney Spears and then I did some jumping jacks with things flopping all around. And then what else did I do? I did a bunch. So I just have the freedom to do whatever I want on here. I can make myself look like a clown if I want to, but I try not to do that, but sometimes it doesn't work. <laughs> so um, overall, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you enjoyed me showing you a different part of my life that I don't really talk about as much. Um, if you didn't know, I have been camming since way before I entered the adult film industry. I started out on a site called F4F, and it was really hard to make ends meet on that site and I was actually camming in my college dorm room. So this is the longest job I've ever had and I know it sounds crazy like that's not gonna last forever and blah 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 but 
Guys, I've made it last a pretty long time. And now that I have a more clear understanding of how to be successful on that website, I've just been flourishing. So definitely check me out on CV if you guys haven't yet. I promise you won't be disappointed. And it's just such a great way to get your day going. Maybe if you're at work and a little bored or, you know, if it's on a Thursday or Friday and it's towards the end of the day and you're just counting down the hours until you get off. I'm not saying be distracted while you're working, but sometimes having me on there can help you just stay positive throughout the day. So check me out over there, guys. Let me know what you thought about this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.